had like one just sticking up in the back. Just like, hello, I am an alien. I'm just going to ruin your hairstyle. I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> What's up, guys? Measy Bear here, and today I am here with my wonderful mom. Hi. And uh, I had her on the mom versus sister tag, and I'm pretty sure I had you on my channel before that. But today we are going to be doing the mother tag, and I'm going to be asking her some questions about me. So this let's could be get awesome or it could be terrible. For it's me. so awkward. What if I don't know the answers? It's fine. It's like a okay. test. What was I like as a child? Just give them a little, a little anecdote. A what were you like as a child? As you are now. You, really? You <laughs> I'm still a child. have your own way of doing things, and you always have. You refuse to crawl or walk or be potty trained before you were ready, because <laughs> you like to do things the way you like to yes. do them. Yes, I remember we have so many videos, like, yeah. I would just be like, I'm gonna crawl and hold on to the cabinets. Walking is unnecessary. Yeah. But you were also <laughs> always very loving and affectionate baby, mm. and, so sweet. and you were a really good sleeper, which any new parent knows is like a big deal. What do you think of me making YouTube videos? I think it's fantastic. I think it is one of the ways in which you can be creative. I think you're really good at it, and I think that it's gonna turn into whatever you want. It's gonna turn into something awesome. It's already pretty oh. wonderful and inspiring. Um, I started making YouTube videos because you guys did. Oh, it seemed sweet. like you were enjoying it, and I like what you put out there. Honestly, I don't know if I actually asked you before making YouTube videos, because Nashi and I had channels since we were like five, just posting really random stuff, and then I was like, I want to be a YouTuber, so right. I was, I started being like, I tried to be a personality on YouTube. Right. What's something funny I did when I was younger? I feel like I did a lot um, of stupid things as a child. <laughs> something funny. You used to suck two fingers on your hands. I was I literally read the question earlier and I was like I the two finger yeah. thing. I like there's just so many photos of me fingers. just like fingers in my mouth just hanging. And and you were adamant about it. So yeah. like we would try to get you not to do it and people would pull them out and you would just like no. Oh. look and put them right back in. Like, <laughs> Dachi okay, had a binky I and I was just like no. She I, we have a photo of her trying to like the, here try this and I'm like yeah. I'm good. You learned to do a lot of things one-handed so you could keep those <laughs> like, I feel like I still there. do that. Yeah. Have you learned anything about makeup or beauty because of me? Yes. Um, I've learned that you can do lots of fun things with fingernail polish. Oh, I've become obsessed with I didn't know anything about really about nail art. Nail art is awesome. I learned time. that from a YouTuber too. And makeup. Well, I always ask you guys what you think of, you know, my outfits and how I look and sometimes Reason? if I try things like eyeshadow and I've stuff. I've gotten so much more into makeup, yeah. except I can't actually do any because one, I don't like have any, and two, my dad is like, that's not nervous. necessary. Yeah. But I, I think the one the main thing is, like, yeah, I love watching YouTube videos about it. I did teach you how to wing your liner, or at least I yes, did do it for you once. I was going to say that on my eyes. You taught me how to make this the pretty little... Beautiful. What's a weird habit of mine? I oh, I know. Measy never eats food whole in its I... whole form. If she gets a piece of oh something, my she finds ways to break it into tiny little shards. I eat... I literally have eaten a cookie with a knife and fork <laughs> And mommy walked to the kitchen. She's like, "What are you doing, child? You're crazy!" And I was like, "And she'll take what things is... that are already small and then like bite around the edges of." Oh, the I do that. Edges. Like, what we used to go to Publix all the time and get a free Publix cookie, and I eat yeah. around the edges, and then I eat them in like these tiny little bites. I think that stems from the fact that when Dachi and I both have something, I try to eat it like as slow as possible so I can have it last. I've always felt like I have to do things last. I like so I can have <laughs> like so I can feel like I have more of it or something like that. I don't know. I cra I crazy. I'm crazy. I'm crazy. crazy. If you had to rename me, what would be my name? I totally would give you the same name again. <laughs> See, the crazy can thing I is... Can opt out of that one? Yes, you can. Okay. When Dash and I were younger, we used to watch Sesame Street all the time. A plus like a bunch of other 90s cartoons that we loved. Um, the one character, Zoe, 
the mm-hmm. orange one who's Elmo's friend. We oh, used to always true. think that we were going to like change our name to Zoe when we got older. We're like, well, I can't remember to change Zoe. my name. Yes. Uh, first of all, <laughs> that'd be so weird, like both of us being called Zoe. And then yeah. secondly, it's just like such a. Mm, I mean, it's a nice name, but also it's kind of a More very common name. Common name. Yes. I think that, that my current Zoe. name is better yeah. than Zoe, in my opinion. If your name is Zoe, I'm sorry. Do your YouTube you. friends know what your real name is after oh, your first I, name? My actual name is Mazan. Salas is my actual last name, but my name is not Measy Bear. Yeah. My name is Mazan. Yeah, we legally changed it to Measy Bear. <laughs> no, no. When we go out to eat, what is my favorite thing to order? Whew. So, like, think about my favorite restaurant and then, like, what I eat there. I don't... Oh, um, did the lighting just change? Yeah. The Come sun back. went behind the clouds. I see. I think it's okay still. Oh, I look good in this lighting, too. We look great. Okay. <laughs> Focus. Um... Okay, so one of the restaurants we like is P.F. Chang's. Can I guess okay. P.F. Chang's? You okay, got, you got the favorite restaurant, right? Nice. Keep going. You love... Singapore street noodles, which is a noodle dish that has veggies and chicken and shrimp usually. Yes, I do get it with chicken and shrimp. My sister only gets it with chicken. It's not... I don't know. Is that your favorite thing of all time? I don't know if that's your favorite thing. I just know that's something you... That's my favorite thing from my favorite restaurant. And another thing that I will get there is... um, Veggie spring rolls. Veggie spring... Oh my god. They are the best. But another meal would probably be vegetable fried rice with orange chicken. Yeah. And I'm gonna, like, quickly just charge my camera, and when the lighting changes and my camera's charged, we'll just keep going. Right. Now, we fixed the lighting, and I charged my camera, so let's keep going. What is one thing you wish I would do? Not drop your clothes on the floor when you take them off. Okay. First thing that comes to mind. Well, it has to be something that I would do because the next question is something that you wish I wouldn't do. Oh, I thought that's what you just asked me. No. What is something that I wish you would do? I wish you would pick up your clothes out. <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, okay. What's something I do that annoys you? It could be very loud sometimes. Oh, I'm really loud. I'm really, it's hard really to loud. Keep in large doses. <laughs> yeah, Dutch and I were in my room earlier, and we were just like scrolling <sighs> through social media and laughing at stupid people, and I was being so loud. And I was like, "Can you take it down in, several notches?" In my office, behind a closed door. <laughs> several notches. And I had to ask her to bring it down. Okay, what is something that I obsess over? YouTubers. YouTube. Yeah, probably YouTube. I obsess over making YouTube videos, making iFunny. a schedule for YouTube videos. I talk about iFunny every day. Like, oh, you know, I saw something on iFunny. That I, that's what we were sc- that's what we were scrolling through yet earlier when I was laughing like a hyena. Where would you like to see me in ten years? Right here. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> in ten years? Um, based on your age at that time. I would like to see you happy, um, working on doing something you feel passionate about, and as far as place in the world, somewhere that I can fly to easily. (laughs) I think that 10 years from now, what I'm hoping to be is out of college and exploring the world with my with my significant other. Or maybe by myself. I don't know. If life goes as planned, then it will be with a significant other. That sounds good to me. You guys remember my team my tag? I said I had a crush. I know who it is. <laughs> we know who it is. So I have to blur out everyone's names, though, in that one mom versus sister tag. I totally crushed that. Yes, you did. Wait, I can't remember who won. I did, I won. Yes, yes you did win. Good job. Check that video out. It's a good one. Okay, when were you most proud of me? Oh, gosh. That's a hard one. I've been proud of you a lot of times. Oh. Can I go do more than one? Okay, you can do um, two okay. to three. The Showing first time you sang on stage 
okay. in front of people. I remember that. I think I was really nervous. The time when one of your teachers said that you were the first student in her class to finish the grade with 100%. Oh, I was so happy. And when you listened to me and resolved a friendship situation you were having and you handled it very maturely. Honestly, I'm really proud about that too. Because I, I would have been so, 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 so sad. And that would have made it really awkward around like our other friends, but I'm glad that we worked that out because it, like it's yeah. it was really important that we did. Those are all things that I think reflect things that I want for you in life. So what is the worst thing I've ever done? I've done a lot of things like that one time I broke my iPod after twelve hours. Yeah, that was pretty bad. I was really um sad then, not because you guys were angry at me, but because you were disappointed and that was like that was like ten times worse. Like I'd I'd rather you yell at me than to just be like quiet and disappointed in me. Didn't you break a camera of mine one time? Oh my god. Was that you? <laughs> Let's make that. That's it. That one was, time I uh, was filming with my camera on that a tripod. That was an expensive one too. And Meezy. I ran in the kitchen and I ran kicked into the, the tripod kitchen and knocked it over. <laughs> I and think I broke smashed it to I bits. broke two cameras that and one of them fell off of something in Dutchin hours. <laughs> yeah. I break expensive things. I bought two cameras. Devastated at the moment. I'm, it was a material thing. Mommy so was I'm really upset. Get over it, but in the moment. Whew. Yeah, material things can be rebought. Oh, heart. But family ties cannot. Ooh. Oh, I need to write that down. That sounds good. Yeah. Okay, life lessons. Okay, Kay. what is your favorite moment of us together? How hard is that? That's okay. I, I loved that riding ATVs with you that was awesome. in Mexico. I really enjoyed that. That you was were so like much an fun. expert, and I was freaking out a little bit. That was really nice. It was though. an adventure, and it was memorable, and it was fun. It was great. Oh, favorite would be hard, but that's favorite that's a would be hard. That's a, that's a really nice favorite one. moment with you is when you came out of my body. <laughs> <laughs> yes, so much. So Dachi Dachi appreciates our comedy. <laughs> That was a good. That was a good favorite. Great one. Yeah. I'm sorry, I can't remember that one. <laughs> Trust okay. me, it was great. Okay, how am I in school? You're a phenomenal straight A student. Mm -hmm. um, mm -hmm. Sometimes you take a little motivation to get oh, going yeah. or to keep going, but you always knock it out of the park. I the think end. that I'm not necessarily a lazy person, but when it comes to something that I don't necessarily feel like doing, I can be the kind of person who will just sit back and not do anything. Yeah. But when it comes, like, I, like, if I just take, like, a short break to do something, let's say scroll through iFunny or Instagram, because I can do that for a really long time. Like, that, videos you might like on Instagram, I could be on there literally for hours. Because you enjoy that I more. was scrolling through it earlier, and I was, like, just on it. I intended to do it for, like, a short time, and I was on there for, like, 30 minutes. I was like, okay, maybe I should... Stop now and do something productive, like be homeschooled. I'd say that the worst thing about me as a student, other than like the diligence of work, is the fact that I can be very over dramatic when it comes to grades. One time I almost graduated a class with a hundred percent, last exam of the class, and I got 99% and I cried. I cried because you know, I was like, I was so close! I've had so many teachers tell me before, like, that's a really good grade, are you sure you want to reset the test? And I'm like, yes, yes I do. Yeah. I think 89 is not good enough. What would you change if you could re-raise me? Like, if you could, like, go what? back to zero I could raise and raise again? me to 13 again? Not a single thing. I don't, believe in, I don't believe in living a life that, that you so want to do over. Sweet. I think you're doing I, like, fine. I think I, you're not in jail. No, you're not doing you're fine. Not you're pregnant. doing great. You're not... <laughs> I'm not in jail, I'm not pregnant, and I don't sneak person. out of it. So, so, that, so if I changed anything... We might upset the balance. So hunted. Hunted parenting. It, doing it again. Good job. Okay, now, this is the question that I want you to do in the most detail. Not just describing the person that I like now, okay. but describe my perfect type of guy. What? Like, a most ideal situation on the planet. If you watch me scroll through Instagram, you probably know this a little bit better. <laughs> Even his looks and everything? <laughs> yes. Oh, I don't... I should know this. Taller than you. 
Okay. At I, least your height or slightly taller than you. I have a good to very attractive when guys are taller than me. Especially because yeah. hugs are much better. Right. Okay, so that's good. That's good. At least your age or a little bit older than you. Hmm, enough I don't, to be mature. Enough to be mature, but I don't necessarily need them to be older than me. Yeah. I, 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 I find myself with a tendency to like older guys, but recently I kind of like younger. Yeah. Dark hair? Very, I, I, I've always thought dark hair was really attractive. Something in the eyes, like eyes that kind of stand out. Yes. Funny. Funny is very important. Adventurous. Yes, because I'm very adventurous and I want to go adventuring. Um, sensitive, like a tender person, mm-hmm. oh, not like yes. Mr. Macho Ego guy. No, I'm not that kind of person. I like yeah. a sensitive guy. I'm doing pretty good so far. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Just... Someone who's okay with you being, like, assertive. Yes, I, yes. Oh. <laughs> I'm a very bossy person. Someone who can handle that, basically. Yes. Not be walked over, but also not try to rule you. Right. And I okay. think that um, you did perfect. Yeah. Now, the his only... His name has to be... <laughs> I'm just kidding. I, just... I, I think, I'm not sure, but I think I kind of have a thing for Asian people. Oh, yeah. It's not yeah. even just because so of the actually have a situation. cultural aesthetic. Sorry to all her non-Asian viewers. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> She's 13. I'm 13. But I think Things that change. one, like, super, super bonus is if you're, like, kind, like, kind of nerdy almost. Oh. Like, how could I forget that? Somebody very, who is... Very, like, Someone smart. who's smart and proud of being smart. And There's like, nothing wrong with if you nerds. have a very handsome face, and then you also have like glasses, <laughs> corrective <laughs> eyewear is. Is I just. <laughs> you should see the people that I follow we just on Instagram. Such a huge population of positive. Now, ladies. see, that's my perfect guy, but like at this point, I'm happy. I, I'm happy with what I have. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, is that that was the last question? Seventeen questions. Dude. Yeah, so and you got all of them technically to right. Say if I know you pretty well. I'd say you know me pretty well. You got my food right. You you know a lot about me as a child. You yeah. know my perfect guy pretty well. It's you wouldn't questions. raise me over again, so that's a good thing. Mm-hmm. I love you. I love you too. Yes, yes. Thank you guys so much for watching. This is gonna take a while to edit. Enjoy, because. like, so subscribe. So enjoy, like, like, again. like this video because it takes a while to edit. Okay, ready to do the outro? Yeah. Okay. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you'd like to see me do for my next video. And subscribe to see new videos every week. Also, check out my mama over here. Hey Brownberry hey is Brown my channel. Mary, I, I talk link about it in the description. crafty she things about like kind of knitting stuff. and This is her sewing. set. You guys probably noticed we're not on the video wall. This yes, is her we set. We are in well, my nest where I create things and I'd love to have you over at my channel at Hey Brownberry go, at go. the Brownberry Chronicles. Go sit in her nest with her at 5.30 a.m. because that's when she decides to film videos. <laughs> I'd love to have you. Thanks for having me, Nisi. Bye! I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a great day and don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment what you'd like me to do for my next video. Bye! I think it's so like nice when you tweet me and stuff. Mom's rule. Mom's rule. Uh, uh, I am Measy Bear and I approve this message. I like being on the Measy Bear channel.